Mr. M. Matil Islam, FCA, Chairman of Jury Board Review Committee for Published Accounts and Reports, RCPAR, ICAB. Mr. M. Matil Islam, FCA, a role model for a civil servant and a chartered accountant who invested his time as first finance secretary, government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh in re-establishing the finance and banking system of the country. His friends and colleagues call him a doyen of banking. Born in 1930, Mr. Islam spent his childhood in Barhatta in Netrukona, where his father, a sub-deputy magistrate, was a circle officer. He graduated securing a first-class first with a bachelor degree in commerce from Dhaka University in 1950. In 1952, at the age of 21, Mr. Islam passed all Pakistan civil service examinations and joined the Lahore Civil Service Academy. And the same year, he also passed chartered accountancy. <laughs> I had a scholarship for foundation to go to Harvard to study public administration, masters in public administration. So, I was going to say that Sheikh Mujib is coming to Boston. Let us go and receive him at the Logan Airport. At the airport, I was going to go to Harvard, Harvard School, Harvard College, Harvard Year Day. So, I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. So, I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. So, I was going to become a constant company. I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. So, I was going to go to Harvard Year Day. That's how I developed the friendship. At the age of 25, Mr. Mathieu Islam was appointed Under Secretary of Finance, Government of the then East Pakistan and went up the ladder very fast to become the additional secretary, finance department in 1963. 10th of January, 1972. 11th, he took over as the prime minister of Bangladesh. 12th, early morning, he sent word that he must come and see me immediately. Okay, then I am Mr. Alamir Rahman. I am the S.O. company. I am American company. I am general manager. I am only a secretary. I am not 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 a secretary. And he said, we have decided to appoint you as the first finance secretary. So I was quite equipped to know what, is my, what are my priorities. Number one priority Shri Lamar, to manage, the, to reorganize the Ministry, Department of Finance. There was no foreign exchange. There was no rupee currency. Nothing. Budget I controlled him, discussing with the ministry, Tariki. He was going to London for some treatment. This is our main public banking sector. Bangladesh is a lot of banks in Bangladesh. There are all West Pakistan banks. There are all banks in Bangladesh. 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 A banking sector to me, nationalized. Only what I will learn the agricultural cabinet, so I will nationalize the banking sector. And all of the banking sector, I do the madam nice quote body, tell the Bangladesh take better. Eight time at my chilo by motto. After finishing his tenure with the World Bank in July 1977, Mr. Islam joined the government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh as the Secretary of Industry and worked for the development of Bangladesh's private sector. In 1993, Mr. Islam went to start three major companies, International Leasing and Financial Services in 1996, National Housing and Finance in 1998, and the latest Industrial and Infrastructure Development Finance Company, IIDFC, in 2000. Now, Mr. Islam, at the age of 92, 
is still a taskmaster. The chairman of IIDFC, a leading non-banking financial institution. Two prestigious awards, the Daily Star DHL Lifetime Achievement Award and the American Alumni Association Lifetime Achievement Award were conferred on M. Mathiul Islam in 2019. Mr. Mathiul Islam is a man of exceptional qualities who has lived his life through a fine set of values. He is an inspiration for us who still actively participates in business, accounting and finance. We are proud of him.